Oh, I missed that. Oh, I missed that a lot. Oh, my God. Well, hello, everybody, and welcome to Red Dead Redemption. I cannot believe that I am playing this right now. I, I cannot believe it. So we're going to play normal. We're going to do the normal story. Um, save could not, um, create a new save game, dude. Okay. That's fine, mommy. Get me in. I don't care. So I am on the PS5, but this is, this came out for the PS4. For some reason. I don't know why. Oh, bruh. No way. Okay, I'll shut up. Sorry. Okay, I guess I can talk over this part. You know, I don't... I don't remember a lot. Honestly, it's been so long. It's been ages. I was... I'm 21 now. When this game came out, like... Was it 2011, maybe? I don't, I don't even remember. But, uh... That's crazy. I mean, it doesn't look too different, but who cares? Like, honestly, who really cares? It shouldn't look brand new. That's what I love about it. I love that so far. bringing civilization to this savage land. I could not agree with you more, my dear. My daddy settled this land, and I know he'll be looking down on us, pleased at how we help the natives. Yes, they've lost their land, but they've gained access to heaven. Hmm. Mm hmm sure. Whatever. But father, do you mean unless an innocent receives communion, they're destined to go to hell? Uh, it hardly seems fair. Uh, what I mean to say, Jenny, is that there is a great deal of difference between an innocent and a savage. I never thought of it that way. Yes, they lived like animals, really? but they're happier now. Uh -huh. You're talking about the outlaws, talking about me. Not only do people now have motor cars, Father, but I heard that pretty soon. We will be able to fly. No, only angels can fly, Jenny. No, no, apparently people can fly. Didn't you hear? Out in Kansas, a man even got a car to fly. <laughs> I hardly think so, Jenny. I hardly think so, Jenny. Only if they knew we landed people on the moon. Mr. Johns wants to run for governor. Which is why he's so concerned with cleaning up the state. Nate Johns. Yes. His family is nothing but hillbilly trash that came here after the war. Right. I don't want to be judgmental, but this state should not be ruled by such a disgusting family. A family without class. Apparently, yes. the John's family have made a lot of money, and he has a lot of friends in politics. Mrs. Bush, money isn't everything. There are many sure. things that money cannot buy. It seems that money can buy voters, though. 
Mm. <laughs> mm. What you must remember, my dear, is that we have been brought here to spread the word. And the word and civilization, they are the same thing. They are the oh, gifts. I, uh, the opportunity shit, what's your name? No, her last name is McFarlane. I don't remember. I don't remember her first name. Why do I remember her first name? And who let you worship in peace? so confusing father sometimes i find it impossible yeah, i'm to surprised this is such a long intro between a loving act and a hateful one i mean they often seem to be the same thing yes jenny it, it is confusing but you only have to ask me if you need help indeed well here we are hmm. mrs bush armadillo armadillo Armadillo. I mean, Dillo. Alright. Oh, frick yeah. Oh my god. Well, I love this. Oh my god. Uncle? Is it Uncle? You must be John Marston. Sometimes. I'm Jake. Your friends from Blackwater hired me to no, guide you. Not uncle. They ain't my friends, but pleased to meet my you. My I got the horses saddled up and ready out front. Let's go then. It's all good, bro. Bro. Nice. Really? Alrighty, Mr. Marson, let's get. I agree. Yeah, take it slow on the way out of town. No need to kick up a lot of dust. Yeah, yeah. Woo now. Yeah, my bad. Force a habit. the story in ages so I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do but I know I'm gonna probably do a couple missions again depending on how long they are though for how old this you game is any time this is gorgeous Marston? i doubt it i ain't planning on staying very long well if you're fixing for some female company you can do a lot worse than armadillo fine as cream gravy they are not like thieves landing dang those girls ain't even fit for a drinking man to hold up with i'm a married man i'm afraid ain't we all <laughs> Hey, we are, oh, jeez. As a husband, I disagree with this 100%. But I will do it. <laughs> yeah! So God. he was a marshal who hired me. Lee Johnson, do you know him? I think I heard his name. Says he got a telegram from some Blackwater fig bugs asking for a guy. I guess it's none of my business. That's right. That's right, bro. Bill Williamson. Bill. So I, I'm so glad I played Red Dead 2 before this. I should do a playthrough on this, and then Red Dead 2. Damn coyotes! What a waste of good meat! Not far 
now, Mr. Marston. The fort's just over this hill. Come on. Give me up. Listen, mister. This here is what's left of Fort Mercer. Some gang yeah. rode in and took the place over. Did they? So I understand. This is where we part ways, friend. You oh, yes, friend. You yourself a good time. Oh, yes. <laughs> okay. I think I get shot, right? <laughs> Something happens. Come on. So I'm pop up. Yeah. Oh Lord. Bill. Yeah, Bill, you can see I'll the shadow. I think. Bill Williamson. Come out here right now. Wow. Go away now, John. Don't make me kill you. Nobody needs to kill anyone, Bill. You must think I was born yesterday. You were. Bro. You always did think I was an idiot. Yes, I did. That ain't fair, Bill. You were as my brother. I've come to try to save you. <laughs> oh. Do I look like I need saving? Yes. Bill, please. They want to kill us all. I can help you. Well, you never tried to save me before. You only seemed to save yourself. Yeah. Bill, I implore you think about this. <laughs> you implore me? <laughs> you implore me. Oh, jeez. You always were one for fancy words. <laughs> oh. Those some big ass well, hands, though. different now, John. Is it? Now I'm in charge. No more Dutch. And no more you. Okay. Implore. I I implore you to go back and tell them to send someone just a little bit more impressive next time. Oh, come on, man. That's not fair. Well. Uh. Oh, jeez. Oh, no music, bro. Just, uh, just cutscenes. Man, it's crazy. Bro. Hurt. Hurt. Help me. Help me. Yes, please. Help me. <laughs> I can't believe I played this game still. Oh my god. It's not a lot of playing right now. It's just a lot of uh, cutscenes. But you gotta do what you gotta do for greatness, you know? New friends, old problems. Let's go. I feel like this has been mostly cutscenes. Well, you're alive. So it would seem. So, how do you feel? He's like, unfortunately. I don't know the polite word for it. I do. Stupid is the word we use around here. What were you doing? I was. Oh. I was doing something stupid. Something well, stupid. You'll be okay. Once you didn't die, the doctor said you'd be fine. He got the bullets out a couple days ago. Good. It cost us $15. I'm sorry, madam. Should have left me there to die. Did you want to die? $15. I mean, was that it? Was that why you went straight out to Fort Mercer and picked a fight with the worst bandit in the county? To in the die, county? Mr. 
Or, uh... Mr. Marston. John Marston. Bonnie McFarlane. Miss Bonnie. Bonnie McFarlane. Well, you may be right, Miss McFarlane. I don't know. Huh. So what were you doing? Just trying to give Mr. Williamson a chance. Yeah. For time's sake. You know Bill Williamson? Knew him. Long time ago. Well, what was he like? An asshole. Just like you. <laughs> See my hat? I have. And, uh, what will you do now? Yeah, that's a very important hat to me. Now I'm gonna take my time and go after him the less kind way. Well, that sounds very fun, Mr. Marston. Quite heroic, just like in those penny dreadfuls my brother used to read. Meanwhile, if you'll excuse me, I've got a ranch. Sorry, I've been taking drinks. Of course, if you're feeling better, why not take a ride with me later and help me patrol the perimeter? You can earn back some of that money we wasted on doctor's bills. Of course. And thank you for saving my life, I mean. Next time, Mr. Marston, I strongly recommend you don't try to lose it quite so earnestly. You got it, boss. I remember, so what I used to do, so I used to like hog tie someone, or like punch someone, and I'd bring them to the top of that barn and punch them off the cliff, and half the time I didn't die. Alright. Back, back. back in the land of the living, I see. Yes, let's do it. about time I started paying back that $15. I sure can use an extra pair of hands around here. Let's see if we can get you back in the saddle. Okay. Sounds... Oh. <laughs> the physics in this game, bro. <laughs> okay. What are we doing? Miss, uh... Bonnie McFarlane. Where? It's also where we lock up good for nothing outlaws such as yourself. Oh, thank you. I'm happy enough with my current quarters right now, Miss McFarland. Okay, let's see if you can still ride a horse. Oh, I can let's ride. Take a tour of the ranch so you can get your bearings. How intense would this be in the past, huh? Like, imagine. To your right is the general store. You won't find Parisian high fashion, but it's good for the essentials. Right. Very convenient. I don't think I've ever like seen a ranch with its own store before. Well, this is my grandpappy ranch. Grandpappy's ranch. You see, he built everything. No expert, but it certainly looks like a fine corral. I suspect you've stolen more horses than you've broken. Come on, Mr. Marston, pick up the pace. Oh, I forget. We're gonna race, huh? That's all. Let's go. That's the barn over there. Paul built it himself when I was just a little girl. Grandpappy? Are you pappy? <laughs> and here we are, back at the house. Let's stop for a while before we head out on patrol. You'll get no complaints from me, Miss McFarland. Easy now. <laughs> get out of my way. What are you waiting for? Come on, I don't fight. Sure you don't. Oh, are we going back to your house, huh? 
What are we doing? What are we doing? You gonna show me how to really ride a horse? Oh, fuck. Seems to take it out of you. I could use a rest. Sure. Come on in. I'll show you the house and then you can sit for a while. Thank you. Mr. Marston. Miss McFarland. Remember me telling you about the trouble we've been having with rustlers and other undesirables? I do. Will you help me keep watch on the property line this evening? Sure. I want to see just who is trespassing on our land. <laughs> it's a fine weapon. Come, let's head out. The country is really beautiful at around this time. Oh, how I'd sometimes wish. We how I sometimes wish I was. Born back then. Come on, then. Let's do it. Let's go. Keep your eyes open and try not to get yourself shot again. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> nice. Not quite the team we shall. I don't believe it. Those damn rabbits are back. Give me a hand with them, will you? Let's see that rifle. I want a couple of these for the pop. Sounds good to me. I want to mind some rabbits, too. I think. Sorry. Drop my phone. We should keep moving. There's still a ways to go. Should we? Yeah. If it's not the rustlers stealing our cattle, it's the rabbits stealing our crops. It ain't never easy living up the land like this. Maybe you should move to a big city. Become a lady of leisure. <laughs> there you go. Come on. Was that a coyote? Get those pets before they scare the livestock. Quick, we're going after the chickens. Slow it up, Eric. Damn coyotes, bro. Okay, so uh, are we gonna have some coyotes too tonight too? Question mark. Gosh, how I wish I could see this many stars at night. I mean, sometimes I can. Depends on where I go, but. I'm lucky enough to do that. People that live in cities probably never understand. Which is sad. Come on. This is you, Mr. Marston. Thank you. I appreciate it. Oh yes. Makes me kinda happy I saved your life. Right. Sleep and I will see you in the morning. Good night, Mr. Or in the morning. I will. Gladly see you in the morning, Miss McFarland. If you sleep, you will sleep. Save game, why not?
No, it was more like it. Alrighty, let's get right to it. I don't have any side quests yet, right? That's where the train is. Wow! Like... That's crazy. This map's so much smaller though than the first, than the second game. The horses are a lot freaking faster though, I tell you that much. Slow down. Oh, psh. Let's do it. This is the racing one, I remember this oh, one. Oh, Mr. Marston. Mr. Marston. How are you doing today? Oh, you know. I'm well, Miss McFarland. Thank you, how are you? Well, I'm fine, thank you. So, uh, how are your ribs? Fine. A little sore, but apart from a couple extra scars, it'll be as nothing happened. Good. Uh, come in, come in. You know, you never did tell me how you met that Bill Williamson or what you wanted from him. No, miss, I did not. Well, why not, if you don't mind me asking? I certainly don't mind you asking if you don't mind me not telling. See, it's a complicated okay. and somewhat pathetic tale, and... By telling you, not only will I be putting your life in danger, but also threatening the lives of some people that I hold very dear. Well, I apologize if I seem to be prying. And I apologize for my reticence. Yeah, me but too. You believe me when I say that it's simply out of respect for you. Of course, Mr. Marston. I understand that a city dweller such as yourself likes to Marston. have some exotic secrets, so us country folk are impressed. <laughs> I'm no city man, miss. Yeah, but yeah, I saw you get on not. the train at Blackwater. You with those gentlemen in bowler hats? I'm still no city man. But I'll bet you can't ride, Mr. Marston. Oh. I hate to take money from a lady, miss. <laughs> oh, you won't oh. be. I'll race you right now. If it makes you happy. We'll see. All right, let's do it. Winner gets money. Money. Winner gets money. All right, I'll show you how we ride. All right, let's do it. Alrighty. Yeehaw. Come on. Whoa. On the count of three. Three, two, one, go. I trust you're not going to be a gentleman about this. You're damn right. What? Already? Who sabotaged my horse? Bringing out, bringing out, uh, baking salt. I guess we'll sure find out. Should I wait for you to catch up? This is fun. I bet you're starting to regret your brave words, Miss McFarland. Yeah, you keep talking smack. How you doing back there? No. Oh. Okay, thank God. Let's go. What? Oh my 
Okej, okay, jag hoppas det. Dorgen, jobbar du? Oh, come on, man. Okay, fine. Okay, I'm ready for it this time. But you're kind of right. Especially after that bullshit that just got pulled. Oh, yes, I do. Horse with better stamina would be better. Yeah. Oh, hey now. That's more like it. Easy. Let's go. Hey, you haven't beaten me yet. Stop smack talking. You're not as bad as I thought you'd be. Isn't this jolly? Come on. I'll catch you. Just you wait. God. Dude. Just don't fly off the edge, Austin. That's all you have to. Why do you do that, horse? It's try doing it again on its own. Sabotage. They train the horse to commit suicide if it starts winning a race. That's exactly it. A sabotage. Come on now. We're almost there. Come on. Nice. <laughs> that was fun. Sure. Sure. You know, you should go pay the marshal a visit in Armadillo sometime. I'm sure he could help you deal with that nice Mr. Williamson. Yeah, I might just do that, Miss McFarland. You do whatever you think best, Mr. Marston. Oh, I will. I will. Oh, I will. See, the good news about this game is honor does not matter. So, I think that's going to conclude our... Uh, you know, you know our video. I'm gonna try something out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna try something out. Is there any people down here? I'm gonna show you guys exactly what I used to do back when I was super young. That was. That's just uh. Hi. Yeah. Follow me. Come on. Well, I will. Okay, come here. Come here. You won't. Hey. Come here. <laughs> oh, hey now. I didn't say you could bring a buddy. But I will take him. Two. Come here. Come on now. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. You just gotta push him a couple times, you know. You gotta bring him all the way up here. Come on. Because they never catch on to you when you do this. I swear. 
I've done it a million times. It's the only reason I got a lot of money, honestly, believe it or not. Get out of here. Come here. Okay. Come here. Come here. Ow. Oh. oh, my face. Oh no. He died. I guess I might as well look for an ID. Boom, plus five dollars. Like that. Exactly like that. Exactly like that. Alright, well. I am gonna leave this episode off here. You know, we did a couple missions. I cannot believe this game is out on PlayStation, like newer gen. It is crazy. I'm so excited to upgrade, uh, 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 I can do all these videos, yeah, but uh, yeah. You guys have a good one, and I will talk to you later. Peace.